kids screaming for help. I seen them coming over the hill. They were staggering, falling down. They were uh, in shock, more or less. They didn't know what to do. Barry lives a few hundred feet from the curve where 14-year-old Laith Massery died Saturday night. This is what's left of the car that was holding six teens, ages 12 to 18 years old, after they flew off of North Verity Parkway in Middletown. This is the North Verity curve that turns from west to south. The speed limit is 35 miles per hour, but neighbors say people regularly do 60 or faster there. It's a very, very high speed traffic area. People do not follow the speed laws there. I went to city council a few months back. Um, they kind of blew me off. They asked, it. first they said they'd look into it, and then they called me back and said I had to get petitions. But a petition does not seem necessary. We obtained traffic records from the curve that show 11 wrecks in the past three years, four in just the past six months. We wanted to know what, if any, speed calming measures have been taken there. The city manager would not allow anyone with the city to go on camera, but released a statement saying the city engages in aggressive traffic enforcement throughout the city and will take a look at the need to target this specific stretch of road. The city also encourages motorists to do their part of being aware of the speed limit and obeying all traffic laws. Oh, I've made all kinds of, of suggestions. What kind of suggestions? A flashing light, a sign at this end uh, and at that end saying uh, like intersection, uh, something entering highway, slow down, something and nothing. One of the things that they could do is put up the speed uh, sign measures that measures it and clocks you. They did it on the other side here and people have slowed down. We reached out to the mayor and all the city council members, but only one, Stephen West, got back to me. He told us he would bring up the issue at next Tuesday's city council meeting. I just wish they would do something before another person gets killed. It, there was no call for them to, to keep blowing it off. From breaking news to feel-good stories, Local 12 has it all. Tap subscribe and hit the links to find out more.